August 20, 2024 makes it exactly one year since President Tinubu inaugurated his cabinet. And this briefing by the Minister of Niger Delta Development is to take stock of his achievement in the last one year in office. It is also an opportunity to chart the way forward for the ministry for the next one year. The Niger Delta region is known for its peculiar challenges associated with environmental pollution occasioned by incessant oil spillage and challenging terrain. But how well has the ministry under Abubakar Mama performed in the last one year? Mama, while addressing journalists on Thursday, outlined the ministry's achievement and the ongoing efforts to accelerate development in the region. He also took the opportunity to provide updates on key projects, including road construction, all geared towards uplifting the quality of lives for the people of the region. Additionally, I recently commissioned the Nebe Ogwe Road, constructed a 27 kilometer road, constructed by the Niger Data Development Commission in partnership with Share Development Company. And this road traverses through a very long stretch of about 25 kilometers with a number of uh, converts and bridges. We have also prioritized the provision of stable and affordable electricity to promote industrial growth and improve living conditions. Key initiatives include the installation of uh, transformers in some communities, such as Eto Community in LMA local government, provision of solar seed light in various communities across Delta State, River State, Ondo, and Akwaibo, commissioning of of the Ode, a regional power station in Ondo State, completed by NDDC. Fielding questions from the media, the minister addressed concerns about project timelines, funding, and the involvement of local contractors in the execution of various initiatives. According to him, the ongoing effort will not only improve the quality of life of the people of the Niger Delta, but will also contribute to the overall economic prosperity of the region. I came in when the 2023 budget was midway, the first budget prepared by the ministry is that of 2024, which will soon become uh, operational. So if you talk in terms of how much to complete this project, the amount to complete the project is dependent on what is provided in the 2023 appropriation, because we cannot go outside the budgetary provision. The Niger Delta region is not only home to Nigeria's oil wealth, but also has become a hotbed of agitations for development. Perhaps the ministry's commitment and efforts towards improving livelihoods and enhancing economic activities in the coming years might be a game changer in the region. Frank Omalape, Arise News.